That's why y'all got closer this time. Last time y'all got further. <laughs> Does it scare you, Dion? A little bit. <laughs> so, how do you guys fix the inconsistencies right now? We gotta figure out what the inconsistencies are first. So, what are the what are the inconsistencies? Just just your night in, night out, starting off the right way. You know, those first ten minutes and, and getting rolling early in the game. Um, I say practice. We have to practice coming out hard and because the practice habits show in in the game. So we have to start practice a lot harder. Why why is it, hasn't that happened up to this point? Honestly, don't know. I wish I had the answer to that. If I had the answer, things would have probably changed. Is that incumbent on you and Naz and Monte and Matt to to be the guys that instigate raising the level in practice? Um, yes, definitely. It has to be. It has to come from from one of the leaders because if the leaders don't go hard, then why why should anyone else go hard? Well, there's a lot of vocal guys on the team. What is player accountability been like, and how much do you get after each other or talk about different things in practice or in the locker room and things like that? Player accountability is, is really high, especially coming from the four seniors. We hold everyone very accountable, and we hold the four seniors at a higher accountability because we expect more from the seniors. Coach Palm's not a screamer. He's you know, not... We've seen more screamers than others. Is it, you know, who's the, the vocal leader among among you seniors? I know who I'm um, guessing it is. But you're in there. Um, me and Naz are more of the yeah. more vocal leaders. Um, Naz a little more than me at times. Me at times more a little vocal than him. So it, it changes depending on that. Is this time to, for you and Naz then maybe to be more vocal because it is the stretch run of your senior seasons, their senior seasons. Mm -hmm. Um, I think, on the line. I think it's more time for action. We can't keep we can keep saying things. We can say all of this, but long, but if we have no action behind it, then what's the point of saying it? So, what do you guys have to do against Oklahoma then to you know obviously get off on the right foot outside of practice? Play hard. We have to start off playing, playing and competing at a very high level. And once we stop digging, stop getting out of holes, we'll be a, a lot better. We put ourselves in a better position to end games. How much of it is, you guys, it seems like you're not at your best unless your backs are against the wall. Do you think that's true? Um, that's what it looks like, but uh, so I, I guess yes. Why do you think that is? When your back's against the wall, you, you're, you're scratching and fighting to get out. You don't want to be against the wall, so I guess, I guess we get comfortable too fast. Is it dangerous to have that mentality down the stretch here as you start getting closer and closer to tournament play? Uh, yes, and we're, we won't have that mentality coming down the stretch. We're definitely going to change our the mentality of, of, of the team. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you.